What's good? What's good? This is Stiko. This is Stiko the podcast. Hey, if you ain't done it yet, do me a favor, man. Subscribe to the channel. And when you get a chance, subscribe to the channel. <laughs> hey, si te gusta lo que mira, press like. Drop a comment in the comment section. I'm always interacting with me, gente, at tu side. And also, share this video on all your social media platforms. I'm talking about the Twitters. I'm talking about the Facebook. I'm talking about Instagram. I'm talking about YouTube. I'm talking about any social media platform you got. Share this video. And when you also get a chance, hit the notification bell to get notified. Don't forget to visit the website, r2drec.com. And then, you know, let's go dive into this one. Mira, see no mira. Splash. <laughs> Yo, let's talk about this one. Do me a favor. Just get you. Okay. Google Mia Khalifa. Now, where's Khalifa? Mia Khalifa. If you don't know who she is, you've been living under a rock, compa. You've been under that rock for too long. If you know who I'm talking about, you know what it is. And we always like talking about these conversations about the uh, adult entertainment because we have to talk about it. We have to. We have to. We have to try something different every once in a while. Mira, con una camisa que dice, I have faith. Woo! And then think about this wardrobe very well, did I now? <laughs> no, look, 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 let's talk about it, man. So I did my research, you know. I was trying to figure out, man, what happened to this female, man? I remember she was the number one topic. She was hot in the game. And I was like, man. And I remember, I'll I be, I be honest with y'all, I saw that video, you know, because then I scarf, he told me, oh my God, this is not going to go well. I told myself, this is not going to go well. Not in that kind of way, but I was I was thinking, man, nah, man, you don't, you don't play with with certain beliefs, certain beliefs, you don't do that. You don't do that. Sometimes you gotta say, "Mira, aquí no, aquí para, aquí para, pero." You stop here. You like, nope, nope. But you know, she got a chance. I'm gonna drop the link in my description because I saw this one specific interview about her. You know, she but it looked like it was like a news, and she was talking about it. It's it's just it's mind blowing. The reason why I say it's mind blowing is because. What do you think was gonna happen if you gonna get in that kind of business? Where they're gonna treat you like fair, like hey, you know what, you know, you know, keep it the nemos, you know, we're gonna treat you right, you know. Come on, man, you in a dope business, entertainment business. These these fellas don't care about nothing but getting, you know, whatever it is. And you know, she's sad because you know the breakups and all this other stuff and the threats. What do you think was gonna happen? You wearing a scarf, a specific religion, and I'm like, oh my God, you can't be that empty up there. You can't. You can't. You can't make this up. You can't be that. Está poquito como que no entiende. Like, I don't know. I don't know. You know, I, I was doing it. What? You knew exactly the minute they did that what was going to happen. But look, I'm not trying to beat on a dead horse. All I'm saying is, what happened to her? Is she back in the dope business? Is she not? I think what it is is that she got OnlyFans. I think that's what it is now, you know? Because I, you know, I was getting to Twitter, you know, you know, Twitter fingers, you know, me, me. Hey, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Now, um, yeah, so I was, uh, I was, I was, you know, sometimes she's doing her thing. She's still, you know, she's still out there, you know, she's still out there. She looks like she's living her best life. However, ever, 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 if any female decides to get in that kind of business, all I'm saying is, thank we out. Be careful, you know, because her story is different compared to other ones that I speak about. Because the ones that I speak about, you know, they, they've been in the game for a while. You know, let's be real. For my understanding, she was only in the business for three months. Oh, three months. <laughs> three months, yo. In three months, she was number one. Her family disowned her. Eek, we're so, bro. But it's like... You know what's crazy? It's like having one foot in and one foot out. You know what you're about to get yourself into and think, oh, ain't nothing gonna happen. And then the other side is like, what if? What if you become that superstar? This is the question I might ask y'all. You know, from an adult entertainment to the business of music, from whatever you do, what would happen if you take off? Are you gonna be really ready for that? If you are going to be ready, go cool, whatever. But if you're not going to be ready, why would you jump in? It's like me, right? You know, I don't know how to swim like that very well. 
But it says that, like, literally, it's 12 feet deep. And I'm like, knowing it's 12 feet deep, am I going to jump? This ain't no motivational, you know, whatever spill. I'm talking about if you know it's 12 feet deep and you barely know how to swim, would you jump? If you know you're an adult at that time and you know it's a it's a, it's a type of business and no no that I didn't know, I didn't know, you know, I didn't know they're gonna do this. You didn't know? Come on now. Come on now, man. Don't play with people like that. You knew exactly what you were doing. That you know, don't make excuses. Stop making excuses. But look, I'm not here to bash on her. I hope that she's living her best life out there and she's doing it 110 percent However, this is a message that, you know, the, don't get involved in something you really don't know much about it. Don't get yourself in something that potentially could eventually hurt you. And by her, she's a perfect example. And it's a, it's, a, it's a story that I think that a lot of people need to put more light on because females or males or whatever, they want to get in certain situations where they feel like I'm ready for it, I'm ready for it. But are you really ready for it? These people have laid down a foundation for y'all, for y'all to see, hey, maybe this is not for you. And uh, with her specifically, like, she blew up fast. She blew up extremely fast. And you got to ask yourself, are you ready for all that? That's my message to y'all. Are y'all ready for that type of fame? Are y'all ready for that kind of attention? And once it hits the internet, it's pretty much game over. It is there for the world to see. And if you are trying to rebrand yourself or do something different, it's going to be very hard. Because I think at one point she was fighting for all them videos to get taken down. But you go to her Twitter account and she's pretty much walking around with nothing. You know what I mean? But you want videos taken down. Why? It's like... But hey, look, I haven't really tapped into it too much. I'm gonna I'm I'm continue seeing if if her if her career, you know, still goes that direction. Not in that kind of way. I, I want to see if she's gonna be more of like the the spokesperson, the one that gives the advice to the upcoming person that wants to get involved in that. To be careful, to take care of yourself, to think about what you do before you do it. Those are prime examples, y'all. And y'all probably saw the thumbnail, you know, este vato va a hablar de esta vieja and she gonna do this. No, this is the other side, right? There are some, you know, entertainers that talk certain things, you know, what they like. But this is the other side. This is the dark side. This is the side that people don't want to talk about. People don't want to talk about it. They don't want to even mention it. But can you imagine getting into an adult entertainment business and then getting threats by ISIS? It gets that deep, y'all. Be careful what you do. Protect your image. Protect yourself. Protect your character. Protect yourself again and again. Man. But hopefully she's doing good. Um, y'all probably follow her on Twitter, Instagram, whatever, you know, whatever. You know, she's still alive. She's still doing her thing. And I hope that she's doing a lot better mentally and physically. That's my message because going through that, Equal, so I fully imagine how dark it would have got. But when you get a chance, subscribe to the channel. Hit the gusta lo que mira, press like, share this video on your social media platforms, and also do me a favor right now. Hit the notification button just to get notified. Seriously, just to get notified. That's the, you get notified, subscribe. You know what it is. And um, when you get a chance, visit the website r2drec.com. And always remember, have peace in your heart, have faith, and never give up. All right, one.